In this video, we are going to learn how to solve this jam physics repeated questions under the subtopic echoes and reverberation. So we are going to practice with six repeated questions for this subtopic. Let's get started. The first one I have here says which of the following characteristics of a wave is used in the measurement of the depth of the sea? We have diffraction, refraction, reflection, and interference. The correct option this question is option C, which is reflection. Okay. The next repeated question will be this question. So it says, the phenomenon that makes sound persist when its source has been removed is known as we have acoustic vibration, we have option B, reverberation, option C, echo, option D, refraction. The correct option is question is option B, which is reverberation. Take note of this question, guys. I have often seen it repeated. The next question will be this one. It says, during a thunderstorm, also take note of this question. The sound is heard over a long time. This phenomenon is referred to as this should be obvious, so it's best a reverberation. The correct option is option C, which is what reverberation. Okay, the next repeated question will be this one. It says the prolongation of sound wave after which the source has been withdrawn is called. I think we have answered this question before. The correct option is option C, which is reverberation. Okay, the next repeated question will be this question. It says in a large telecommunications auditorium, perforated absorbent materials are used to line the ceiling so as to so have option A reduce the height of the ceiling from the floor, no increase the reverberation of sound in the hall, no reduce the reverberation of sound in the hall. Correct. So right option here is option C, which is to reduce the reverberation of sound in the hall. Alright, the last repeated question before I end this video will be this one. It says the prolongation of sound wave after which the source has been withdrawn is called. I think they have repeated this question three times now. So the right option is C, reverberation option C. So this is basically you can do problems involving echoes and reverberation for your jam physics. We practice with six repeated questions. We are dealing with repeated questions. So we practice with six of them. In this video, hope there's something interesting. Let's create a video, guys. If you are new to our channel, ensure that you are subscribed to this channel by hitting the subscribe button for more of our videos. Also, like, share, and comment on this video. Let me know if you what I learned from this video. If you seem to have any specific questions asked regarding what I talked about in this video, feel free to leave your question in the comment section below and make sure to give your response. Also, ensure that you are part of our channel membership by clicking on the join button where you'll be receiving special information that will help to simplify your academic work. So join us now if you like indeed. Click on the screen and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.